coach won't be here next season. And I think we have to be very happy with the job he's done until now and with what he has to do from now until the end of the season with three competitions still in play, which we have to fight for. So evidently we have to accept the decision of our coach. It's his decision and we have to support him like we've always done. So the season ends in the best way possible, of course, by winning. It's true what he said that last summer he told Robert Fernandez and Albert Soleil that he was thinking about the possibility that this would be his last season. And we've been waiting, and a few days ago he told us that he had decided he wouldn't continue, that he would find a good moment to announce it, and today, with this game, it was time. I think it's good that he broke the news now, with the season still hanging in the balance, so we don't have to guess any more as to whether or not Luis Enrique will renew. He has said he won't, and from here forward we can focus on playing football. We still have La Liga, we have Paris Saint-Germain next week, the final of the Copa del Rey, so we still have a lot of work to do over the next three months, and ideally we are firing on all cylinders. So evidently, Luis Enrique will say farewell this summer, and he's been a real super coach during these three seasons. He told them today, after the game, he told the players that he wouldn't continue next season, and of course everybody's a bit sad because he's a good coach. We're very happy with Luis Enrique. He brought us a lot of success, lots of success until now, and he can still bring even more. Like I said before, there are three competitions to play and the players are extremely motivated to continue playing strong this season, like we saw today with the 6-1 to victory and in all the competitions, and they have to keep it up. There's a training session tomorrow, and then the day after, and then there's a game and it never stops. It doesn't stop until the end of June. Relaxed, normal. I'm sure that that's how he'll work until 30 June. Luis Enrique is our manager. And then from 1 July, maybe we'll have a new one. But for the time being, let's focus on football, which is what matters most. The next game's coming up. Some of them are very, very important. So this is the work that needs to be done. And we'll talk on 1 July. For the moment, Luis Enrique is Barca's coach until 30 June, and we have to give him all of our support, which he has had until now. The same support he has always had with the players and coaches and move forward in this season which is an exciting season. We still have three competitions to try and win. Well, in two seasons, he won eight out of ten. Now we're in the third season, and we still have three titles to win. The truth is that is as good as it gets. Barca's success in recent years, we win, we put forth a very good image of the club and the team around the world, and we've made our fans and our members very happy, and that will continue. This isn't over. There are still three months left until the season is finished. There are three very exciting months, and we saw it today. Games like this, uh, we host Celta next, but nobody should have any doubt that Luis Enrique is one of the greatest coaches in Barca history, and he still has a lot left to do with these three months, even if it's not a lot of time. There are many games left, a lot of work, a lot of effort, and that's what we have to do now. Get the support of everybody and get behind the team as always.